That's good. That is good, I think. One second. Yeah, yeah, no, it's good. slightly crooked, but it's supposed to be crooked. Yeah, I yeah, have to do it because the tripod's sliding. Happy Sunday, guys. Hey, guys. Homemade breakfast McGriddles for me tonight with some turkey sausage on the side. Funny story about these bad boys. I messed up the first batch, and I tried mm. doing sear. I tried, you know how you put butter in a pan to, like, lube up the pan so there's no sticking? I tried doing a little bit of butter spray, and then I put the syrup down also. And the pancakes just didn't cook right, so Kaki's like... These are going to have to be um, redone. They didn't cook right because they stuck because you poured straight Syrup, sugar yeah. on the freaking pan. I wasn't thinking. <laughs> I wasn't thinking. So I have two McGriddles, just eggs and cheese in here, four small pancakes, and then six turkey sausage links. Very light dinner, I guess. You know, I did the stepbrothers deal today when Kaki was at a birthday party. I took, um, I didn't even tell you, tortilla chips, and then I put... <laughs> shredded cheddar cheese on it <laughs> stuck it in the microwave for 50 seconds <coughs> and then brought it upstairs and finished watching a documentary I started two weeks ago the Ronnie Coleman documentary hello Abby oh hello Abby how are you hello I'm sorry I've been really busy getting ready for surgery I'll be down for six months oh girl I'm very sorry about that yeah sorry to hear looks so pretty khaki oh thank you yeah I went to a birthday party today and I did a whole bunch of nothing <laughs> watched the documentary, relaxed in bed, watched the, you know, I finished watching the Ronnie Coleman documentary, and then I gotta move that light back, and then, uh, yeah, did, I didn't even get the full run-in tonight, I've been having, like, flu symptoms all day long, but I think it's just from the cookies and the pizza, like I'd go through every weekend, something's gotta change. You're doing okay, yeah, I'm sure you're pr pretty stressed about your surgery, I mean, I would be too, I would definitely be stressed about it. Funny story about the party though, our daughter wanted to walk to her friend's house today, which it's really not that far. It's really not. And I was like, no, 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 we're just going to drive. And we get there and like, I knew the mom and I knew the grandma because I see the grandma every single day. Yeah. And they're like, oh, would you like some wine? And I'm like, you should have walked. I should have walked. I should have walked. But no, I drove. But next time I know to walk. <laughs> yeah. We were there for, I was like, how, damn. How, how, how we long? were there for like, for like almost, three hours? Yeah, like three hours. We were there for a while. Felt like you were gone the whole day. No, we left at like quarter to one. Party started at one. They literally, three minute drive away. So they don't look far. But I was like, damn, I should have walked. Should have listened to our kid. Should have walked. Uh, oh, well. I know for next time really now. Good. Yeah, so I made a Greek salad tonight. I never crave salads, but yes. your salad looks really <laughs> freaking good. So I made a Greek salad with these little mini spinach pie things. They're like spent little mini spenacopitas. So yeah, I have that. In my salad, I put lettuce, tomato, red onion, yellow peppers, orange peppers, tomatoes, and feta cheese. Feta cheese, I could see. I almost, I came this close from getting the McDonald's adult Happy Meal. <laughs> yeah. Our location, it's currently unavailable, so didn't happen. I'm like, I'm just gonna make something. It went from being mac and cheese and broccoli to McDonald's to, you know what? Because of the snacking I did today, I could just go for a big breakfast, you know, end the weekend the right way, and then gear up for Monday. Which, planning on getting my momentum back. Uh, yeah, Abby. Um, I did Jamie's hair. Kaki did my hair. She did it last night too, but she only did the endings of it. And I wanted to see what it looked like if she did the whole thing. Uh, so, I like it. I think it's different. I hate my hair when it's straight. I always feel like I get the scarecrow. Um, I, give, I give off scarecrow vibes. So... <clears throat> Some might say it looks girly. I don't mind that. I actually, I like this a lot. And I'm not going to do it tomorrow. I think I'm just going to put my hair up in a bun when I shower tomorrow. And hopefully it, it lasts. Because it didn't really last from last night. But you didn't do it as... This morning, it was still curly. Like when you came downstairs, you took your hair out. It was still curly. Yeah. Like I did my hair earlier today. It's still curly. And I brushed mine out. Maybe that's why, Abby. Maybe our adult. Yeah, it was sold, sold out. out. 
It looks I think good. everybody. I think everybody was going nuts over the adult Happy Meals and like went out and bought them all up. I think that's what happened. I'm gonna let TikTok in, okay? Mm -hmm. Is it bad to do this to your hair? A lot? No, you just need some heat protectant. Okay. So maybe we'll do that. I don't know. Let's see how this plays out tomorrow. Let's see how it looks tomorrow night with not wet my hair. Or maybe I should wet my hair. You I need to wash your hair. No, it's still good. You need to wash your hair. It's still good. Don't tell me to wash my hair. <laughs> you need to wash your hair. Does it smell? No. So why? It's greasy though. It's not greasy. It's just it, how it's it, supposed it. to be. <laughs> All right. Back in the day, do you think people washed their hair when there was no houses and people lived in um, caves and stuff? But you don't live in a cave. No, I don't. But I'm just saying. <laughs> you don't live in a cave. You live in like it's how it's real supposed world. to be. Yeah. No. Mm -mm. Hey, Gina. How are you? Happy Sunday. Oh, hello, Gina. How are you? Uh, uh. Um, you know, I always say happy Sunday, and truth be told, going back to work tomorrow, not too excited about it. Not too excited about it, and I usually am. I'm more excited about getting my momentum back. The goal for tomorrow, and I'm not going to jinx myself, so I'm not going to tell you what I want to do. But the goal tomorrow is to get my momentum back, and I have an idea how to do it. I know exactly how to do it. I don't perform well when it comes to like uh, like post weekend runs, mm -hmm. like on Saturdays. I haven't had a good Saturday run in a while. It's my sixty second birthday. Well, happy birthday, Dawn. Oh, happy birthday, Dawn. Mwah, happy birthday. What's up, Trevor? I had wings today at two different places. Definitely was... My cheat day. Very nice. What's on the menu oh, tonight? Oh, hello, Corey. Hi, guys. Hey, Corey. Uh, homemade breakfast McGriddles for me. And then Khaki's got a Greek salad. I get to babysit your favorite little girl. Very nice, Abby. Aw, that's so nice. nice. Oh, you know, so we, we were talking last night about how I watched how the new Halloween yesterday. My brothers went to go see it today at the movies. They didn't like it. They were actually went and paid money to go see it. <laughs> yeah, they didn't like it. I'll give you guys a close-up of mine because I didn't do that. I think, I think they came out pretty good for throwing them together, not knowing mm -hmm. what I was doing. The only thing I'm missing is bacon. Which we yeah, don't. we didn't have bacon. We didn't go to the store today. Tomorrow's another day. I want to do Sloppy Joe's tomorrow in a different way, different form. I have a feeling I might not like it. I guess I'll have to wait and see. Yeah, everybody's... I, so, Corey, I liked it. I actually... I could have did without the first 10 minutes of it, but, you know, I, I enjoyed the movie. Do you guys plan on seeing Smile? No. What the heck is Smile? Is movie? Nope. Yeah, it's like... No, yep, nope. I don't know what smile is, Abby. I've never heard of it. I'll have to look it up. Uh, looks fire. Enjoy, my brother. Thank you very much. Go Eagles. And, oh, baby. What's up, Mike? <laughs> so, Go smile Eagles. is about this thing. This It's like a demon that I'm sure you've seen the trailer where the girl is just always, like, giving a sinister smile. Like, and no, no, I oh, It's a movie you would probably want to see. I'd probably like it. Have you seen The Gray Man? No. I don't even know what that is. My sister saw it, and apparently it's extremely scary. The whole movie theater screen. Scream. Yeah, it seems Ooh, like... Oh, I have to watch it then. Yeah, it seems like it's probably going to be one of the scariest movies of the year. Smile. I wonder if I can stream it anyway. I'll have to look it up. Gray Man was really good. I actually watched the trailer. Oh, hello, Stacy. Here's, here's the deal with Smile. There was this girl that was going to baseball games and she was, she kept on being, she had like TV camera uh, seating area and she was just doing the creepy smile. And everybody was talking about that, that movie's going to be so creepy, so creepy. So I Googled, I YouTube smile trailer, watched it. I'm like, Ugh, that's definitely not for me. That's right, I'm looking it up as soon as we're done eating. <laughs> <laughs> That's a movie that won't have me going. That it will keep me up. I don't even. I'm not. I'm not interested in it. It'll keep you up. So the new. So should I hear Mila Kunis movies? Smile at you. I'll have to master this girl. Smile and just smile at Jamie. She even said in. Uh, 
pouring rain. During the delay, delay yourself. by yourself in the stands. Yeah. All right, don't tell me no more. No, I'm this gonna... is what the girl did. You saw it was on TikTok? Yeah, it's creepy. I d I don't Hello, look it. alive. My brothers want to see it. Like I said, it's Maybe I'll go with your brothers to see it then. Go for it. Have fun. Don't want to know anything about it. <laughs> saw enough in the trailer. I haven't been to a movie in a really long time. Uh, what's up, Venom? It seems that all you ever eat is garbage. Pizza, chicken wings, pancakes, <laughs> etc. Good luck with that, bro. Thank you. Aw, oh, thank you. Thank you for your kind and positive words. Thank uh, you. It's just a bunch of jump scares. LOL. Yeah. It's just a bunch of jump scares. I have to watch it. I gotta watch it now. <laughs> it seems like a movie I would have liked when I was younger, but now, no, not so much. Did you two have a good day? Uh, yes, I had a relaxing day. Kaki went to a birthday party with our kid. I and, had a good day. You know, and it was just, you know, weekends are... Uh, Jamie, I never saw you drink water. I don't drink water. <laughs> At all. I drink vegetables. I know a lot of people get on me on that one, but just never... On a hot day, I will, but... Maybe worth a watch, but definitely don't spend money to watch it. Okay, Corey, thank you. If I can stream it somewhere, I will. You're not ready for the snow, Greg? What's up? Kel snow hello, Kelly. Yesterday. Hello, Ke hello, Kelly. It's snowed already? Where are you from? <laughs> that it snowed already. <coughs> I just choked on a piece of lettuce. Uh, Kool-Aid gang. Absolutely not. That's not a uh, that's not a group I'm a part of. No. Shall I get into these pancakes? All right. Thank you, Abby. As Kaki is eating a salad, they don't always eat junk. Thank you. I mostly we don't. I most I I would say I eat a lot my 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 fair share of junk food, but I'm not mm, I don't feel bad. I really about don't it. though. You don't. The worst thing I had was Burger King. Yeah, you don't. I do. I'm not, but it's I don't care. It's not, it's not, anybody that comes in here gives me shit about what I'm eating. Yeah, I know. Got news for you. All right, and I'm serious. It's not your body, it's mine. And you don't know what I do. And you don't know, you know, what it is I'm actually taking in at all times. You assume. You assume. So, assume what you Hello, want. Kilo. How are you? Yeah, you just assume things. Like, you don't see everything you just assume do you blend up your own veggies or use powder yeah they're fresh vegetables do you realize how grateful you are to have such a lovely wife oh i know oh he knows i know what's up matt want to know something hello though. matt hello deborah we had a little bit of a tiff tiff today we're not gonna go into detail but hmm. just a little tiff tiff let's just leave off saying i was right she was wrong no that's it oh this is good <laughs> No, my laugh alone. Hello, mm -hmm. Pam. Nice breakfast, thank you. Yeah, this is good. You want to try this? No, thanks. I'm not really in the mood for eggs. Neither was I, but this is really good. Hello, Pam. Uh, what's my rating? Yeah, he wants to know your rating. Breakfast sandwiches, I would give it, I think this is a solid, like, I don't know, 7.8, 7.9. It's not, it's not bad. This is really good. We have anxiety about snow. I hate snow, Stacy. I hate it with a passion. My hands are going to get sticky, but that's just because I'm dealing with syrup tonight. Kathy being wrong, highly doubt that. Yeah, I wasn't. That was Jamie's way of admitting that he was wrong and I was right. <laughs> are we still talking about this? <laughs> shrimp is a fruit <laughs> of the sea. Yeah, we like shrimp. Oh, I love shrimp. My wife says midlife crisis. I said, okay, girlfriend or Corvette. And guess what I got? <laughs> Corvette? I guess what? The Corvette for Jamie wouldn't wouldn't help him out with the camera angles and crap. So, <laughs> good luck trading me in for a Corvette. <laughs> Can you see me in a Corvette? No. I see myself being a truck guy. No. Is that a Cobb salad? No. It's a Greek salad, and it's actually really good. And I didn't make it how I normally make it, because normally I usually use tzatziki sauce, but I didn't have any tzatziki sauce. So I crumbled up some feta, and then mixed it in a bowl with some... What's up, dark mullet? With some... <laughs> oh, 
with some. You made me lose my train of thought because you were giggling. <laughs> Dark mullet here. <laughs> Remember I made the mistake last night? Yes. That <laughs> was a cool so, move. So I mixed it in a bowl with some um, Olive Garden dressing and made like a Greek style dressing with that. So yeah. Summer goes fast and winter lasts forever. Here's the good news, guys. We're just about in November, right? November might be long. December shoots by because everybody loves Christmas. <laughs> January could be either or, and then February is a short month. So it's like, before you know it, we're going to be, you know, ending in winter. Yes, let's, my salad is very good. Let's do this as a team. Let's get through the winter together. I try to make the best of it. Let's hope it doesn't snow that much. Hello, Lisa Marie. Sal looks yummy. Evening, Khaki and Jamie. Hope you had a great weekend. Had a great cookie corner weekend. My cookie pie that Khaki made me last night, because the side of my mouth is, I kind of hurt it the other day eating trail mix, I asked her to make my cookie pie a little bit thinner and it was perfect, nice and soft. The spoon goes right through. I live in Florida, so we don't have much cold. You're lucky we're glued. I'm jealous of that. We'll be in Florida sooner than later. Mm -hmm. I hear two and a half men in the background. Best mm -hmm. show ever. Yep. Yes, you do. Two and a half men are usually on Saturdays and Sundays, and then the rest of the week it's king of queens. Yeah. Your mouth okay? Just a little bit sore, Gwen. I uh, did a crunchy nut. What was it? An almond and some trail mix. You were eating your mom's trail mix. Yeah, I was too, because that trail mix was addicting. That trail mix was so freaking good. It was peanut butter chips, white chocolate chips, almonds. Regular chocolate chips, almonds, yeah. cashews, peanut. Oh, my God. It was so good. And craisins. There was, like, craisins in there, too. I challenged Jamie to a duet. Doing to what? a duel. A duel doing what? Someone asked what how we... What type of duel? Someone asked how we first met. We met for, for during karaoke. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I wonder what kind of duel... Like a food duel? A running duel? A running duel? If you would have if we would have ran against each other tonight, you probably would have beat me. Very out of it on tonight's run. I have to get going, but have a great rest of your night. Kaki and Jamie, see you again tomorrow. You got it, good night. Oh, good night, Corey. Mwah. Thank you for stopping in. Uh the wife is eating healthy tonight. Yep. Yes I am. I have to be... I don't think I ate pretty bad last night. I had pasta with a bunch of veggies. Mm, you have to be buzzed for karaoke? No, not me. I don't need to be buzzed. For me to be good, I gotta be buzzed. <laughs> Actually, I sing better when I don't drink. <sighs> Duet of who cooks Duel the of better who cooks the improv, better improv meal. meal. I'm pretty so, good at that. I don't know. It's so like you get like a... X amount of ingredients. You have to figure out what you're gonna make. Who picks the? It's kind of like chopped. That, so you want to do like an episode of chopped? Is that what you're talking about? Who picks the ingredients? How do we go about this? Normally, they're just given to you, but I think it would be fun to do like a Russian roulette. You pick crap out of a hat. Then you get a protein, a vegetable, and like a starch, and you pick from a hat from each one. I have to figure it out. I think that'd be cool. You would be going against the master, Jamie. I'm actually very good with picking from limited ingredients I have. Usually my best meals come out of stuff that I didn't have to go to the store for. It's stuff that I have to kind of see what we have in the fridge or see what we have in the freezer or the pantry. And then that's when my creative meals Yeah, that's gets, when they come to life. Get rolling, yeah. So, I don't know. That's a pretty dangerous you know, thing to do with me. I have to, I don't know if this week's Let's go, I can go live too. <laughs> me and Kaki will judge. Uh, did a hi from Canada. Hello. I have oranges and limes and lemons on my trees and bananas. Very nice. Oh, nice. The duel looks dangerous for you, but I'm ready. <laughs> it would be fun. It would be fun. That would be fun. That would be a lot of fun. I don't think so. Here's the weird part: the sandwiches are good. The regular pancakes, 
I'm not crazy about. I don't think I'm gonna eat them. So you're more than welcome to have some. I don't like the pancakes. All right. The kids will eat them. Our kids love pancakes. I, I like, like the roulette idea. Yeah. You pick something out of a hat, and boom, that's your protein. There's your starch. There's your vegetable. Figure it out. Yeah. Season it however you want, like whatever ingredients you have in your house. I want to do, I started off tonight's dinner by saying um, I want to do some sort of sloppy Joe meal tomorrow night. I have an idea on doing it a different way than you usually see, see sloppy Joes. So I think I might want to do that tomorrow, but we'll see. My mind changes all the time, many times a day. If Jimmy gets anything with hot dogs or bread, I lose. Probably. Seen some sick things Jimmy makes with those. <laughs> yeah. <coughs> yeah. Probably. I'm good with hot dogs. So there's this one, and I, I'm not going to tell you what it is. I but wouldn't. No, no, no. There's this one bag of something that I've been looking for for like the last two weeks, and I can't seem to find it. And I'm looking forward to doing that meal, but I have to find it first. I was looking forward to the balsamic chicken meal you were, ta you were talking about last week. You're like, oh, I'm going to do something with balsamic. I got bad news about that one. I didn't write it down and I forgot. <laughs> of course you did. <laughs> this is why I need to walk around with a black book. Just, I need to have something because I, I'm... You walk around with your phone all day. There's a notepad in there. Start speak texting things to your freaking notepad. You don't need a book. What did you just punch on? You heard that, right? That might. You punched on something. I heard it. Eggshell? That did not sound like an eggshell. Let me make sure my teeth are all <laughs> Hold on one second. That did not sound like an eggshell crunch. Normally an eggshell crunch is only something you can hear. I heard it. Do you have all your teeth? Um, hold on. Oh God. Front tooth, no. I have you an eggshell. Did you lose a filling? I only had one filling. I lost that once ago. Maybe it you wasn't eggshell, too, but that was loud. Did your tooth crack? I don't think so. I think I should go to the bathroom and look, right? I think you should definitely go look, because that was a really loud crunch. Right. And you didn't have anything crunchy. Maybe it wasn't eggshell, but... <laughs> Give me one second. I don't want to go inspecting Jamie's chewed food on the paper towel right now. Yeah. Excuse me. Is Jamie down for the count? Oh, snap. No, he's going to go check his, his teeth. My goodness. Hello, doll. How are you? Close that. Go check. Yeah, he's checking it out now. That definitely sounded louder than an eggshell. Like, way louder than an eggshell. Like, I remember when my tooth cracked. I felt it immediately. But it never made a sound like that. I just felt it like in my mouth. That was a very loud crunch. A really loud crunch. Are you good? I think so. I think it was an eggshell. I don't well, know. It was wanna... a pretty freaking big eggshell. I don't know if I want to finish it. I don't know if I want to finish it. Abby, you said you heard it, right? Mm -hmm. A lot of people heard it. Can an eggshell make that kind of noise? Hello, doll. Sound like something hard in the pancake. Yeah, no. Yeah. Unless there was something in the pancake batter. Well, it's in my belly now. Or in that napkin now. You went to your reunion last night. Get Should I bullet. dissect it? You went for it. I would. I wasn't going to do it because that's your food. Well, I'm, well, I'm glad be... you went, doll. That's awesome. Sound like a broken tooth, right? That's what I'm saying. It sounds like all my teeth are here. They're all accounted for. I think I'd be dissecting what was in my mouth. 
There's a piece of spinach. <laughs> <laughs> no, not that loud. Yeah, I don't know. It's in my belly, I guess. You swallowed it? I don't think you did because you stopped chewing. Well, I'm dissecting the best like Oh, wait, here we go. Yeah. What is it? Eggshell. How the fuck did I get eggshells in my eggs? Yeah. Oh, the culprit. A... Big piece of shell. How did I miss that? And why did it sound so freaking loud? I don't know. Well, we found it. Rock the spinach. Hello, Danette. I heard it too. <laughs> Sounded like you bit down on a popcorn kennel. Eggshell. We're no, good. it was an eggshell. It's confirmed. I don't want to finish my egg though, though now. How do you find an eggshell? It might have been the last two eggs that we added last second where I kind of did it real quick. Hello, Tanner. Jamie, you got to tell me. Tell you what. Well, it was the crunch. It was an eggshell. It's confirmed. It was an eggshell. Listen, I'll be honest with you guys. I ate so much today. The, the crunch kind of threw me off, turned my stomach a little bit. I'd rather go into work tomorrow on uh, less of an empty stomach anyway. Uh, that was a loud eggshell crunch. I'd be, I don't know. I don't know. What's in the green smoothies? It's all vegetables. Pick a pick a green vegetable, put it in your juicer, add a little bit of I'm ice, add a little bit of water, and you're good. I don't use kale. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Made that mistake once. One time Kaki picked me up a kale blended mix and she didn't realize it. And that was the night I, I said I my, thought I picked up spinach. Yeah. I picked up spinach and kale. Yeah, and that was the night I said my my. He's my, like, this doesn't taste right. Tastes like sour milk. She goes, well, it's, I do the same thing, and then sure enough, the next day she goes, hey, you're right. I picked up mm -hmm. a kale, uh, blended mix. Mm -hmm. I was definitely thinking kale. No, I don't do kale. I tried it once. I can do kale if it's like chopped up really small in a salad, but I can't just eat kale. Mm -mm. What's up, Dennis Brady? Make another cooking video? I will, tomorrow. I only cook once a night. Just once. And on the weekends, it's usually reheating pizza. Thank you, Tanner. I remember I was at a Chinese buffet. And I bit into a dumpling. And something crunchy was in there. I didn't know what the hell it was, but I didn't eat another bite. Turned my belly. Didn't your brother like bite down on a squid or something? What? Didn't your brother like bite down on a squid or something when they were at a Chinese food buffet? I have no idea. I'm pretty sure he did. I remember your mom telling me the story. Doesn't ring a bell. Heading to Sunshine. Hello. Hi, what's the lovely wife eating for dinner? A Greek salad. I have a Greek salad. I've got McGriddles with eggshells in it. Hence why it's staying on my plate and not going in my mouth. Hey, I've always said I'm not the best cook. <laughs> I make mistakes. And eggshell is one I don't think I've, I've... I usually catch it when it falls in. Ah, pretty makeup tonight. That's for you. Oh, thank you. My makeup's the same every single night. Thank you, user. Sometimes the heart is perfect. Sometimes the lines are... Bulky and thick, and doesn't go for the the. Um, the believe it or not, it's, these stripes are not easy to do. Got to work with the edge of the brush so it goes to a tip. Can't be just lines. I bet you didn't know that. I did not know that. Same thing with my chest. Same thing. These things are not always easy to do either. Need some syrup for those pancakes? Kevin, I'm not eating no more. Jess, you're making me want a salad? I'm sorry. This salad is freaking delicious. The salad is so good. I'm glad I made a salad and didn't make anything else. 
Sassy Steph, why do you keep talking about the eggshells? Question mark. Life's short. Yes, it is. And but it when an eggshell ruins your dinner, yeah, you kind of have no other choice but to talk about the eggshell that ruined your dinner. Yeah. If you don't like eggshell talk, I'm sure there's a whole bunch of other people that are not talking about eggshells. But for the time being, I'm going to talk about eggshells. <laughs> I'm going to fight with Jamie right now. I'm, I'd be pretty pissed that I wouldn't be able to eat the I'm rest not, of my dinner because it was ruined by a freaking eggshell. I'm not. I'm not super hungry. So it doesn't matter. It's a win-win. I can't complain about it. I still have my juice. I have Oreos in there too, but I don't know. <laughs> Oreos don't have eggshells in them. You're safe. No, I know. Good night, user. <laughs> oh, good night, user. Takeout, always a good choice. Domino's probably would still deliver. Maybe not. Sunday mm, night, 1230. No, they would not deliver. No. I think I'm just going to call it what it is and, you know, not eat the rest of the night. You know, have a good day tomorrow. Can we be TikTok friends? Rom Zombies chick? Maybe. I don't know. I, you know what, I, um, yeah, I don't know. Uh, you said you don't want this? Mm. Take my shakes in the back. We'll save that for the kids, though. They'll probably eat that. Uh, my red block. Thank you, Kelly. Blocked sassy. For being rude. Well, I don't think about she was being rude. Eh, she didn't have to say that. Oh, she said something else that we didn't catch it. You know what I mean? Mmm. Hey, those pastry puffs are in there. What is in them? Spinach and cheese. And I think feta. They're like little mini spanakupitas. They're really good. <sighs> Hi, beautiful people. Enjoy your content. Thanks for sharing with us. Oh, well, thank you. Oh, thank you. You look like Macho Joex. Man. Oh, I get that a lot. Yeah, that's he gets that all the time. You get Macho Man. I get um, X Pac. Uh, Seth Rollins. Mm -hmm. I get. Who else do I get? Roman Reigns. Some football player. No, I don't go get Roman. I was him. in Five Below the other day with the, with our daughter. And they had like a Roman Reigns thing, but it was like a mask. Oh, these are good. A Halloween mask? It was like a toy thing. Um, I looked at it, and I was like, hey, look, it's Daddy. And she started laughing. She was yeah, it does look like Daddy. <laughs> yeah, yeah these, are, these are really good. I'm not I have a whole more, big bag of them. Yeah, that should be good for me. Eight times? Damn. Where's your plate? Behind me, I'm not eating no more. You know what's kind of funny tonight that like the dogs have like free roam to wherever they want to go. And they didn't come down. And we have not one down here. Lucky was down here and I guess he, he came didn't down, like what we made. Got a drink, went out to pee and then disappeared. Uh, green beans, fried potatoes, chicken with some balsamic. That sounds good. I gotta go. Talk to you later. Rock on. Rock on, man. You let me know when you're good to go. I'm not gonna force you to eat. Eat. Uh, uh, I'm just... I'm not eating no more. Okay. You don't want any of my salad? No, I don't even want to try it. Okay. No, I did enjoy my plate of nachos I had in bed, though. <laughs> Clean your mess, Jamie. Yeah. Jamie has a habit of making a mess and not cleaning it. And not putting his clothes in the hamper. I've been pretty good doing that. <laughs> yeah, quite a little did tip you, yesterday. Did when you I eat had anything it. at the party? I did. Only because I wasn't going to eat. I literally just sat there with my bottle of water. And then they started handing out pizza to everybody. 
So I got handed a slice of pizza. Nice. Was it good? It was all right. It wasn't from a place that we've had before. It was from a different place that I've never heard of. Macho Man's my favorite. It was okay. And then I saw that they had salad, so I made myself a salad. And then I had that. Excuse me. And then I had a piece of birthday cake. The birthday cake looked really good. And I had to try it. It came from a really good bakery. And it was quite delicious. It was really good birthday cake. And then I had a little mini, I had a little mini bite-sized brownie. <clears throat> Snap into a Slim Jim. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> I like Hulk Hogan and Andre the Giant also. Yeah. The classic guys. Can't go wrong with them. Well, hello, Melanie. How are you, bro? It's all good. Hey, Deborah. Hey, Princess Pants. He's bummed now. Sorry that happened to your meal. It's all right. You want to see the kitchen when I'm done cooking? Category five. Yeah, let me tell you something, Dennis Brady. If it wasn't for me cleaning up as we go, it would be a category five in this kitchen. Hello, Princess Pants. Hello, Bam Bam. What's up, Bam Bam? Yeah, we have our own, I always say this, and not a lot of people are in here when we're talking about how we go about the cleanup. The set that you guys see is very um, time-consuming. There's a lot of stuff, and a lot of different places each of the lights go, and uh, you know what the monitors are on are, are these, these tables. They go downstairs, the Dream Tower goes downstairs, all the ring lights go downstairs, these black curtains that you guys can't see and then these blankets that we have on the table goes into a big gold briefcase that you have to fold up and certain lights and extension cords go in there. That's the part I do and then Khaki takes care of like the dishes that we use or the pots or mm -hmm. the counters that are cleaned. I usually like to have the dishes done and the stove clean before we sit down and eat dinner. I make sure that's done, but then I have to put everything away, like, after. I missed you. What happened to your dinner? I had eggshells in it, so I stopped eating it. Sorry. Very loud crunch on an eggshell. Thank you, Melanie. You break down every night? Every single night. Every single night. I don't know how long we've had this set now. Over a uh, year, for sure. Good night, Dennis. Thank you for stopping in. Well over a year. It's been well over a year, right? Well over a year. Yeah. When we first put this set together, or when I first created it... Was it you, it not was, me. But like when we first started setting it up and breaking it down, it was not easy because we didn't have a routine. We didn't have a, a set things to do. Now I know what to do first. No, I know what to fold first, what goes down first. So we got it down pat now, but at first it was hard. I'm like, did we, did yeah. we, did I set it something was terrible. up? terrible. Like, too much to chew? That's I'm dedication for oh sure. God. Yeah, you got it. so bad. If I were yeah, to... Teamwork makes the dream work, Melanie. I say that all the time. I always say that to our kids. Teamwork makes the dream work. If you all work together, it'll get done faster. Ortiz, they are from New York. Yes, we are. So every night is a late night, late night for you guys. Yeah, yeah. We usually don't eat until midnight, and we're not in bed until one thirty. Yeah, so every night is a late night for us. Yes, every night is a late night for us. It's a schedule. It's a it's a five years now doing this. So, and you would think it would have gotten easier, mm -hmm. but we add more stuff and. You know, try to stay fresh. So we are, we're always trying to change something up. But yeah, it's a lot. It's a lot. And get like four and a half hours of sleep, and then we get up and go to work. And then we come home and do it all over again. It's rinse and repeat. Yeah, I don't <laughs> think. I think. Uh, yeah, it's literally like. I think with a lot of how social media is now, a lot of people film content to. Touch my to, to, to spread out through the whole month, right? So any kind of extravagant um, s 
you know, scenery you see, it's done all in one day. We do yeah. the same thing over and over again every single night, cooking different meals every single night, and then we go live to show that what you see us making was actually, was actually just actually real, yeah. Uh, how do you stay so fit eating like you do and so late? Um, I exercise a lot. Count my calories, eat my vegetables. I'm not the perfect role model to be uh, <laughs> when it comes to like my choices of food. I get that. Wish I lived further away so I could watch on my break now. Right, I'm done. I'm done. And and you know what? The people that do those t those things where they'll make a whole bunch of content in one day and then dish it out the rest of the week, not nothing wrong with that. Mm -hmm. I just like having the whole. What you're seeing is what you're getting that night. Don't you? And think that's understandable. Eating so late then going to bed affects your REM sleep, your no. REM sleep. No. Do you know what it does to me? Puts me right to bed. Right to night night. Out like a light. And let me tell you guys, we appreciate you guys and all the hard work shows. Guys, thank you. Oh, thank you, Melanie. Oh, yeah, thank you very much. Lucky dude. Here he is. There ain't nothing here that the he wants. The man, the myth, the legend, right here. That's why he uh, went upstairs before. Hey, buddy, I don't have anything. He came down to see what was left. Nothing good. Nothing good, and I'm not going to give you eggshells. He's turned into a seagull. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, we, I've always been, like, uh, asked for years, don't you think it's bad to eat and go to bed? It hasn't affected us in a bad nope. way. Hi, guys from Seattle. Hello. Oh, hello, Jing is one. You can come up here, but there's nothing up here for me. I don't have anything. Come on. Please, sir, may I have some more? <coughs> <laughs> yeah. There he is. Can we see the handsome guy? Yeah, there he is. He's licking the crumbs off the table. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. You ready for bed, guys? Mm -hmm. All right. We will see you guys tomorrow night. Have a good Monday if you got to go back to work. He's <laughs> eating the pa oh, pastry. Let crumbs. him eat the pastry. Something oh. less I have to clean. <gasps> <laughs> oh, he clinked you, didn't he? You made your, you made your teeth clink. Yeah. It's all right. <laughs> Why would you do that? Right in front of He didn't face. mean to. It's not like he knew. At least he didn't get my nose. At least it was just my chin. The nose would have been the worst. All right. Good night, guys. Nice dog. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. Uh, dude, have a good night, dude, guys. Uh, watch me have a big bump on my chin tomorrow, and you won't even be able to see it.